Let's say all I eight post in the East Kerama LLG of the Gulf province is one health facility that has been left alone to cater for the LLG's entire population, including people from the central province. Unlike some rural aid posts in the country, it is not isolated from urban areas of the province, including Port Mosby. But for the last 24 months, it has not seen government assistance. For the last seven months, community health workers have been delivering babies in the dark using torch lights from their mobile phones. For the last seven months, we have been delivering mothers under torch lights and mobile phone lights. We have been delivering babies who have all missed out on the hepatitis B vaccine which is supposed to be given at birth. Most deaths recorded in the eight post were from preventable diseases. Insufficient supplies of drugs and vaccines are the main problem of the facility. Yesterday, oil and gas company Into Oil presented to the eight post the country's first ever solar energy powered vaccination fridge. The solar powered fridge will be used to store vaccination for baby immunizations and anti venoms for snake bites. Into Oil Community Affairs Manager Thomas Kevaro said the assistance is part of the company's community outreach program. Kevaro said the company is obliged to deliver its services to the communities the company is engaging with. We hope that this donation, though small, will be very important and also will save a lot of lives of snake bite victims and also the lives of young ones that are born so that they are humanized at that stage so other dreadful disease do not occur, do not come into them. In the meantime, the Lesser OLI 8 post will continue to serve the people of East Kerama in the central province with what little it is. And the solar energy powered vaccination fridge will help the aid post in a small but important way. Stanley Over Jr., National MTV News.